when taking an inverse, you always want to switch your x and y values first, like this. Now you want to get y alone again. So what we do is we say x plus 4 equals to 1 over y minus 1. What you can then do is take this y minus 1, multiply it across, but in a specific way. Keep it all in brackets like this. There we go. You don't want to actually multiply these two brackets together because now what we can do is we can divide by x plus 4. And so we're going to end up with that. And then in the next step, we can take the minus 1 over to the other side where it will become a plus 1. And there we've done it.